this is gonna be so incredibly cool. I see the next five years as being South Downtown is gonna be the place where people wanna to come to. It'll be a lot busier, but busy in a good way. Like there'll always be something to do. When people have an opportunity to live and work in the same area, your quality of life improves. You're not commuting, you have things around you, so I, that's super exciting. South Downtown is where Atlanta began. These streets, Peachtree Street, Broad Street, were some of the most thriving, active, mercantile streets in the city of Atlanta. This was the shopping district. This is where people would come on purpose to buy their goods on the weekends and bring their families. But now downtown is beginning to have that vibe coming back again. I love this city. This city is so beautiful, so fresh, so new. You think it's boring and dead at night, but it's actually secret pockets of bars and restaurants and rooftop parties. It's just so lively and vibrant down here. To be able to look out the window, to view downtown, to get out the elevator and view the uh, Mercedes-Benz Stadium and the State Farm Arena. And this place is live, it's clean, it's nice, it's professional, it feels good, it's well taken care of. And we grew up in the city, so we're used to city. We like being in the city life. Whether it's coming into a coffee shop, whether it's going to Nomos or Wine Shoe or Bottle Rocket or Elliott Street Pub, people know these businesses. You know, there's something really cool about being below street level. You know, it has this sort of mystique that who knows what's going on down there. This is really cool. I need to come check it out. I think it's going to be a natural place where people are going to want to come down and congregate. Plus, it's a lot cooler than it is up in the sun, so that helps too. It's going to be massive with massive entertainment, walking and shopping and stairs up to the second levels that'll have the same thing. And office space on, on that side, so there's kind of a built-in clientele when it comes to what we do. And then apartments directly above us, which is also the same thing. We plan on having a lot of regulars that are just either work in the area or live in the area in just this building alone. And then you imagine everyone that's walking to Mercedes-Benz and State Farm and the hotels and Hard Rock and everything else. Next to two world-class you know, sports venues, was definitely a draw, but the bigger picture, they're gonna develop the Gulch into this entertainment mecca with retails, restaurants, and residential. We wanted to be the early adopters and be in early rather than later. I think the Canyon's gonna be pretty amazing with what we do out here, fire pits and, and seating and everything else. But the bridge and the view, uh, I that's kind of that's 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 gonna be my favorite, I think. This is gonna be an amenity for everyone to come and enjoy. It, it, there's no clear dividing line of South Downtown and Centennial Yards. We're all sort of morphing together and providing an experience for people to come down and enjoy.